So if you have expired tags or an unregistered vehicle, consider yourself warned. Colorado cops are teaming up and they're cracking down for a high visibility campaign. Our Karen Morfit is live tonight with what you should do now, Karen, certainly before you start to see those flashing lights in your rearview mirror. Absolutely, Karen. If your license plate tags are more than 60 days expired, say maybe 2022 like this vehicle, it is time to get to the DMV. There's a push through July 1st by those agencies to target these vehicles right now. And we heard from some agencies that say they have officers, multiple officers, writing more than 20 tickets a day for just this. This push comes after a large number of community members raise concerns. With millions of cars on the road in Colorado, it doesn't take long to spot one, two, even three that have an expired license plate. I see ones that are like from like two years ago, like a year ago, um, like six months, nine months, like all over the place. Local law enforcement agencies say they're seeing a jump in the numbers. A trend Aurora Police Lieutenant Kerrigan Bennett says started during COVID. The DMV shut down and for only a little while. But during that time, people got the general impression that, hey, I don't even need to register my car. Years later, and people are sick of seeing it. Two years, like what's going on? Because two years, it, you should have your stuff together. A lot of our community members are very concerned about that, and they, they have expressed concerns to us about needing to enforce that. And so we are doing a high visibility campaign. APD, the Arapahoe County Sheriff, Adams County Sheriff, and Douglas County Sheriff now making it a point to go after those violating vehicle registration laws tags that are more than 60 days expired and you could be stopped, ticketed and fined. Failed to register your new vehicle? The state says you'll pay back taxes and fees dating back to the day the vehicle was purchased. It's more than just, oh, it slipped my mind. You had an opportunity and you didn't take it. That's what we're really focusing on here. Now, there are a number of ways that you can renew your vehicle registration online. Some counties have personal kiosks. You can always go into the office, and we did reach out to the state DMV. They say, to their knowledge, all county-operated motor vehicle offices are open. And if you're wondering where all of the money from these fees goes to, it uh, supports emergency services and improving our roadways that these cars are on. We're live in Denver tonight. Karen Morfitt covering Colorado First. We were just talking. They do make it kind of easy. Easy on us to pay those tags, get those tags. All right. Thank you, Karen.